Hey guys, Jeremy here from the Archer Shack. Wanted to do a quick video on how to change the draw length on the Santa Dragon X8. One thing to keep handy is the owner's manual because it tells you at what position the draw length is. And it also shows you that as you get shorter on the draw length, you do lose a little bit of poundage. So I've had a few people ask, you know, I shortened my draw length, lost a few pounds. Is that normal? It is. It is. So we got a, a Dragon X8 bow here. I'm going to flip it over. It's pretty simple. Uh, one thing to note is the little hash mark here is what you're looking at as far as a number goes. So that mark is going to coincide with what the draw length is. But to change it, uh, all you do is take... On one side, you're going to remove this screw. You're going to flip the bow over. You're going to loosen this screw. Now, on, in this case, it's behind the limb. You don't need a bow press. What I do a lot of times is grab this cable. Now, don't torque it left or right, but just pull it, and it will come out from behind that limb. All you got to do is loosen that screw because this is going to rotate. And then you're going to look at your chart, see what draw length you're looking for. Uh, with this screw out here, rotate the module to the right number, put the screw back in, tighten it down, flip it over, tighten the other screw, make sure they're both super tight. Same thing on this end, make sure whatever you put it on on the top, you do on the bottom. Keep them the exact same. Same thing here, here's your hash mark for your, for your number. You can adjust them in half inch increments, which is good. And that's all there is to it. Uh, just any the advice I would give would be make sure you get those screws back tight and if you shoot it you know let's say you put 500 shots on it and you hear something rattling always check and make sure that you put that on tight and that that module is not loose because it can if that were to happen maybe you didn't tighten it up enough or whatever uh, you don't want it to come away from the cam and this cable gets stuck down in there so that's all there is to it let us know if we can answer any more questions about it. Uh, again, this is a great little bow for the money, and it's pretty easy to work on. So let us know if you have any questions, and thanks for watching.